My name is Marie Miguel. I'm a production lead here at Interlux. And IP stands for an inspector packer. I like to say that we are the first stop in the Interlox train because in order for assembly to build the belts, to center the customers, to actually put into effect, first it starts here. We have to actually produce the parts, cut them, pack them to the specification to even send them to be built to the customers. When I go into the production floor before my day starts, we have a huddle and the lead at the time gives us any information to the IPs and let us know uh, any changes that's going to come up for the day, any issues that we may, that we may have. So there there aren't any surprises. After the huddle, then I proceed to go and get my relief or get my hand off. So I'll go to my designated area, I'll talk to the IP that's there or my team member, ask them which parts they have, they'll hand that off to me, and then they'll let me know if there are any issues throughout the day with those specific parts in that specific area. After that, typically I'll check the area, make sure everything is clean and organized, and if everything is good, our handoff is good, they're able to leave and then I take over the bank. After that, the first thing we do, or I do, is calibrate all my scales and then make my boxes. I typically like to make my boxes for the entire shift. That way, if it's time to close a box, I can immediately remove it, place a box in its place, and I'm able to keep my flow going. Each part is packed completely differently, and the way we know how to pack the parts is by reading our part packing sheet. Each part has a part packing or a job kit that has the part packing sheet in it. It has a label that lets you know how many parts go into that part packing procedure. Our quality person issues a sample tag. We can take that sample tag to the station where I'm gonna print it out at and match that sample tag up with the job number that's on the computer. I close the box and then I place the label on the box on the pallet. That's just another step to ensure that it is going to the right place every single time. The good thing is because we have so many molds that produce so many different parts, it keeps it interesting. Are you able to pay attention to this part today? pay attention to that part tomorrow, or even within the same workday because we do rotate banks every six hours, so you're not stationary at one place for the whole 12 hours. I do enjoy working at the company. It's a great company and the morale of the company and my team members that I work with make my work much more enjoyable, right? So we're able to laugh and we're able to joke, but we're also able to do our job. They're really big on being self-managed. As long as I'm still doing my work and producing the parts and packing them correctly, I have full control over doing so, which makes for a great work environment. And it does make you feel appreciated because you have control over the things that you're doing every day. I think that with it being one of the top companies in Louisiana, it screams job security. Great benefits, uh, you get your 401k, insurance, health insurance, dental insurance. There's a pharmacy right down the street. There's an on-campus gym. I mean, you can't beat that. They didn't have all of these things <laughs> at my previous company that I worked at. It wasn't a fully stocked break room. They really set it up where you really don't have to leave to get anything. You have the food here, you have the gym down the street. I can go to the gym on my break. I choose to work here mainly because of the schedule. I love my schedule. That's the best thing for me. I love it. and I'm off every other weekend. And the benefits, of course, <laughs> you get sick. It's nice to know that you have insurance. I still earn plan time off or PTO. I hardly ever have to use it because my schedule is so set up. I can plan whatever I need to do a sense of pride. Um, so when people ask, hey, where do you work? Because they'll see my uniform. Like, hey, well, where do you work? And I let them know. And they're like, oh, what do they do? Like, oh, well, actually, they're number one in their industry. You know, we produce plastic, modular conveyor belts. I love to talk about it. I love to tell them what I actually do at work. And they're like, oh, well, you seem like you like your job. I'm like, I do. Come on over. Fill out a nap.